Hey there, this is the Ergo Slider Plus Plus. Plus Plus? Or maybe it's just one plus. Either way, it's an ergonomic cursor control made by Fursgo. They sent me the one I have here so that I can try it out and share my experience. So, let's get started. The Ergo Slider Plus comes in two pieces, the wrist rest with the buttons on it and the roller bar. Simply place the roller bar into the designated track and plug in the USB to get started. No drivers needed. Now let's go through how the Ergo Slider Plus works. First, you have the roller bar and that is your main cursor movement control. You can also press it down for a left click though. Below that, there's two narrow buttons. Those are back and forward. And underneath that, you have two larger buttons. The left one is left click and the right one is right click. Finally, in the middle of all the buttons, there's a scroll wheel. You can also press down the scroll wheel for a double click in a single press. Using the Ergo Slider Plus was surprisingly intuitive for me. Roll the roll bar up or down to move the cursor up or down. Slide the roll bar left or right to move the cursor left or right. And if you happen to hit the end of the track but you need to go a little bit farther, simply push it a little bit more and you should feel and hear a click. This indicates that the end detection function has been activated. And what this means is that it'll keep going in that direction that you're pushing despite your roll bar hitting the end of the track. Now onto how to click and drag things. There are two ways to do this. The first method requires just a roller bar. Simply press down on the roller bar to activate the left click and then move the roller bar around to move the file around. I found that this first method is a bit cumbersome since it's very difficult to press down on a roller bar and also roll the same roller bar. So I prefer the second method. The second method is a lot simpler, but it always requires both hands. Take one hand and click down on the dedicated left click button and use the other hand to control the cursor by moving the roller bar. And finally, onto scrolling up and down. Well, just use a scroll wheel, as simple as that. With the explanation out of the way, I'll now tell you my experience from using it. As stated earlier, figuring out how to use it was very intuitive. So apart from still instinctively reaching out to my old mouse location, and maybe a tiny bit lower in cursor accuracy, I had no real issue controlling my cursor with it. Though it should be noted that I'm referring to normal usage and not drawing or gaming on the computer using it, because it's definitely not designed for that. So, so far, everything's good, but nothing is perfect and I do have an issue with it. And that issue is that the roller bar sits a little too high. I really wish it was recessed a little bit more because when I'm typing, I do end up hitting that roller bar with the bottom part of my hand. And this is a bit of an issue, especially if you're typing some long Word document, because if you hit that roller bar in the middle of typing, well, you now have the second half of a sentence in another paragraph. So that is my only real gripe with the Ergo Slider Plus. Now let's talk about the most important thing. Is the Ergo Slider Plus ergonomic and better for your body? Well, I'm not a medical expert, so I can't comment on a professional medical level, but from my time with it, I did not experience any pain on my shoulder or wrist, which sometimes I do experience with a normal mouse on a long computer session. So based on that, I gotta say that it seems to work. And I guess I do recommend it to people who want to prevent shoulder or wrist pain, or they are already feeling the pain and wants to avoid it. So overall, I think that the Ergo Slider Plus is a product that is pretty well thought out and designed and does prevent some injuries and pains. But does this mean that everyone should go out and buy one right away? Well, while I almost always recommend you to buy things that are better for your well-being, I'm afraid not many people can afford the Ergo Slider Plus. At 170 US dollars, this does not make any financial sense to a lot of people. But on the other hand, you may still want to consider it because your well-being may make it worth it. If you guys liked the video, consider leaving a thumbs up. If you guys want more, consider subscribing. And if you have anything else to say, leave in the comments below. I'll see you guys in the next video.